area chart area chart is also something which is used in pretty much same context where we use the line chart let's have a comparative view for example here you see you have got a line chart which is representing the trend of the stock price for three companies by the time right so that's the purpose when you want to see the trend by time for that the best suitable thing which we create is line chart and in the same context you can represent this same kind of trend or you can use the visualization to show the same trend or maybe same kind of representation for that purpose you can create a area chart an area chart the only difference is you might have already seen the area chart right so what you see in line chart you only see the lines but in area chart what you would find is the space between x axis and the line are filled with some color something like this right so when you have the area chart you're gonna have the view something like this this is an stacked area chart right you can have different form of the area charts right but this is just stacked so for example let's take the value you know let's consider about this ibm price okay ibm price so what you see over here so in area chart if you would observe the ibm price which has the highest is coming in the front and etc so it does not have to do much with the stack much with the sequence but it is just a way of stacking of this okay so let's let's focus on this so if you see over here the space between line and the x-axis are empty but in this the that space is filled so exactly this is how uh, i mean in this context we use the area chart now let's quickly see how can we create the one so for, to create the one all that you require to do is go on visualization tab and choose the area chart there you can find two kind of area chart one is simple area chart the other one is a stacked area chart so i'm going to start with the simple one so i just clicked on this and here is what i got right now i need to put some value into this how can i do that so for that i would just choose date first to show on x-axis then close price to show the values now here what you see you see the overall pricing right now to split that into multiple parts i just click the stock that is category uh, categorical part let me show it again to you through a different method right so over here you see x axis right in x axis what i'm going to do is take date and drop it over here then close price i'm going to put in y axis for that i need to scroll down and then y in the y axis i'll put this and then the stocks which i'm going to put in legends right over here now you see my i got my area chart created over here you can see the each of the area chart is overlapping to the other if you don't find it look visually appealing you can change it to the stacked one right now you can see this is showing uh each of these three in sequence and in a stacked manner so you see this uh, how simple is it to create an area chart it's just a different method of visualizing the trend by the time that is it now to play with the visualization what you can do is you can go on this uh, visual tab and from here you can uh, you know edit the uh, edit the visual representation from here from shape you can you know play with the uh, play with the shape style as well so now you can see the lines are dashed if you want to make it thicker you can do that as well now let's see over here if you want you can change this as well uh, uh, all right so this this all will play some role into it if you want to change the color the color can be changed from here let me put it gray and you see that area is grayed out okay so similar in the similar fashion you can you know make the edits as many as you want from using this using this visual uh, tab rather i can say in the in the visualization pane and from here also you can uh, edit the overall graph level effects okay from over here if you come you can you can change the background as well something like this right so you can make it more effective as per your uses right so this is it in the area uh, in 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 area chart if you want me to create something um, yes, if if you get any doubt and if you would like me to create uh, something more advanced do let me know into the comment section i'll definitely make a video thank you once again for watching this wish you